Surprise. So. <laughs> I'm over here fixing breakfast. And I would just like to say that a package came in the mail and it seemed worthwhile to open it up on a video because I was like, you know, what could this be? And I go to my Amazon account. And I'm like, this looks interesting. Because, so our Amazon account, we have two teenagers, a tweenager, and a eight-year-old with autism. So I don't think he's ordering anything, but who knows. But I can see who's ordered what and their debit cards. Oh, God. Everything in, everything in this house has syrup on it. Hold on. So this is what came in the mail. We're going to look at this in a minute. And this is a Serpy iPad. We're going to charge before we go to the peanut, the peanut parade. <laughs> Good morning. Supporters, we're going to have a, our own video right after this. To, we have some things we need to discuss off the record. And yes, I have this apron on because I don't have on a bra and I'm trying to fool people. Um, my coffee. My supporters already know what's in this poster box because we discussed it this past week. Okay, hold on, let me get it out. Innocuous Adrian Wood Fulfillment Center. Now, I asked my children, did anybody order a poster? No, nobody ordered a poster. So then I said to my son Thomas, it says there's a poster. <laughs> I thought you were getting domestic. It says there's a poster that's been ordered and the billing address was your dormitory at Episcopal High School. And it was your debit card, because everybody has their own debit cards hooked up to what they order. So it's not me paying for stuff. I mean, basically I'm paying for it, but there's some sort of responsibility. No, my brother didn't have the Farrah Fawcett poster. But my roommate in high school had the Obsession poster with the naked fanny on it. And my brother was horrified. So, he says, this is my 15-year-old. I said, you didn't order a poster? No. I said, well, it was you know, looked like it just went and shipped to the right place. He goes, well, you can just send it. Ding, 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 ding. Do I have like dumbass written on my forehead? I could just send it. I know that I, I was sneaky, sneaky, sneaky teenager. I mean, you got me. You've just admitted when you say you can just send it. So then I say, did anybody use your account to order a poster. And he says, you've already asked me one question. I'm only answering that. Bingo. So someone, or he's, or he did it and he's lying, has ordered this poster. Now I want you to look at this poster and I want you, and don't go being sank to mommy on me and saying, I this is horrible in your child. I know it's horrible. Well, that's the most important part of the poster. I mean, it is like a 1980s naked fanny. I mean, who orders things like this? It's so inappropriate. And so then I had an idea. Actually, somebody gave me an idea. Hold on just a minute. My Sharpie. You know what I'm going to do? I am going to mail him this poster. And I'm going to write on it. I'm going to write right on this shirt. Or maybe I should write on her fanny. Oh, this is in the right color. Let me go get another color. Get 
my, my bucket of Sharpies. Okay, what's a good color here? Well, maybe just black is safe. Now, what should I write on there? I love you, Mom. Should I write it on the fanny? Or should I write it on the tennis dress? Or enjoy this picture of me when I was in the 10th grade? Draw bikini bottoms on her first. Well, that's an idea. Draw bikini bottoms on her. Okay, hang on. Okay, I'm gonna draw some underpants. Uh -oh. Maybe with a little eyelet. Oh my God, the cap has got my apron. Okay, drawing the underwear. I mean, there, drawing a little bit of underwear. But now I think I need to color it tennis bloomers. Yeah, but there's no color. I think now I'm gonna write something on her, her dress. I'm gonna write, to Thomas. My high school tennis photo. Love mom. Do you think that's inappropriate? Yeah. Is it offensive? No. She's offended. What? It's on Monday at Ridgecroft at four o'clock. She's darn right offended, and she should be. So this should be going to Episcopal and I'll carry on with the underwear. Good day, people. Good luck in your parenting because clearly, not good over here, not good. And if you need a group, come over to my supporter page. At least we have each other.